Hey guys, how's it going? I am the Conflict Nerd. Hello and welcome back to Hawken. So, in today's video, I want to talk you through Team Deathmatch. Now, it's pretty standard, but over the next couple of videos, I'm going to be talking you through the various modes on offer right now in Hawken. So, Team Deathmatch, it is basically what you would expect from a Team Deathmatch game. It is first team to kill 50 players. That's it. First team to rack up 50 kills will win. And it's pretty much the easiest mode to jump into. It is the first mode that you're likely to play. It is the first mode that I would recommend. Purely because it is probably the mode that is the most pick up and play out of all of them. I wouldn't suggest Missile Assault or Siege or Deathmatch until you were pretty confident with your abilities in something like Team Deathmatch, and you will find out why when it comes to looking at each of those modes. Team Deathmatch is what it says in the tin. You want to play as a team. So many people won't do it, and it will piss you off to no end if you're a bit like me and you like playing as a team. But, just trust me on this, if you play as a member of a team, you know, get some friends and play as a group, as a squad, you will do better than someone who's playing on their own. Hawken, whether people like to admit it or not, is about team play. Work together, get shit done, have a technician to repair you and harass the enemies, have a sharpshooter to harass them from a distance, have a heavy guy going in and blasting them to bits, and have a couple of guys who are, you know, mid-class, class B, just being infantry. Get enough people together, working together, and you will completely dominate the field in Team Deathmatch. There's a great selection of maps on offer, and it's just a fun mode. If you're wanting to kick back, relax, and have some fun, then go and play Team Deathmatch. And that is as simple as it gets.